halftime in a basketball game, you typically evaluate what's worked and adjust to ensure you come out on top in the end. It's the same at the halfway point of a season. NDSU is looking good as they reach the midway point in Summit League play. Just a half a game out of first, they expect to end the half on top tonight. Hosting a struggling Denver in this one at the Shields Arena, but it sure doesn't look that way early on. But then again, Denver's throwing up granny shots like this one, and that goes in. But on the... but. On the bison till the herd ties things ties things up. I got too excited there. AJ Jacobson with a great bucket there hits the long two from the corner to make things 13-13. Seriously though, that shot. Denver not going anywhere, drilling a three. They extend their lead back to six. Dave Richmond not happy with the state of things. Bison with nine turnovers in the first half alone. Carlin Dupree closes the gap to four with under a minute till half. But the Pioneers answer again on a wide open backdoor cut that I'm sure someone heard about in the locker room. 10 point game at the half, but second half, Corey Brown opens things up for the Bison, goes baseline on the Pioneers, a little backboard love, and the fans, they're back in this one. That works so well, they look for it again. Brown on the same path and come in a little bit of contact, makes things a little bit tougher. He grabs the offensive board, though, and nails the putback, had a career high night on the boards. Then I leave and clearly turn the buys in favor. Lawrence Alexander picks up his first points of the game and puts himself over 1,500 career points. This one heads to overtime, tied at 47, where the Bison put it away 61-54. LA with a team high 21, the number of the night as the Bison claim their 21st straight home win.